As an entrepreneur, you can lose many different things. You can lose money, you can lose a talented employee, you can lose a power of supply, you can lose a great client, you can lose many different things. It's going to be painful, it's going to hurt, it's going to sting. But if you lose this one thing, then you are done because this is the kiss of death. And that is your energy. Energy is basically the impetus behind every motion and activity. When your energy goes, everything goes. As an entrepreneur, I have had a couple of losses that I'll share with you. 2010 March in South Africa, Johannesburg, I was attacked behind Park Station. They robbed me of everything. The only money that survived was in my inner pocket. And don't ask me which pocket, just know that it was in my inner pocket. 2012, 2013, farm season. I did a massive tomato project. During the ripping time, we are picking in excess of 500 crates of tomatoes every week. But unfortunately, the price of tomatoes fell from 150 kwacha per crate to seven kwacha per crate. Seven kwacha, a full crate of tomatoes. And that seven kwacha, by the way, could only cover transport costs to the market, nothing more. I remained owing workers and a couple of other people. It was a painful loss. And the saddest of them all was in 2014, 24th August. One of my trucks was involved in a tragic accident with 600 bags of maize for FRA. When the truck flipped, the villagers looted over 500 bags of maize. We only remained with a handful of maize. And unfortunately, the driver had loaded the cabin with eight people, eight passengers who were badly injured in, in the same accident, who needed to be compensated. Prior to the accident, I had gotten 22 tires for the truck on a post-dated check, and each tire was costing about 3,000 kwacha. Now imagine that kind of a loss, and to cement it all, negligently on my side, I had not properly insured the truck, meaning I had to meet all those expenses from my pocket. It was a very painful lot. I was really hurt. But you know what? I did not lose one thing. And that was the energy. Because I had the energy, I still remained resilient, determined, resolute, and focused. And I knew that provided I still have the zeal, I'll make it not long from now. I was so determined and I felt it within myself. And not long from that experience, I've led two companies from scratch to being market leaders in their respective fields in Zambia, all because I still had this fire. I may not know your experiences, I may not know the losses that you have had, but I can tell you one thing. If you still have the energy within you, the drive, the faith, the passion, the impetus, if you still have that, know that one day you will make it. Just maintain the energy, keep going. It's gonna work out one day. This is Dumisani and the future is bright. As an entrepreneur, you can lose many different things.